On Saturday night, after a dramatic 2-1 victory over Canisius, members of the Army hockey team participated in an exhibition sled hockey game against the Long Island Rough Riders in a 20-minute contest. Showing impressive quickness and puck handling skills, the Rough Riders skated to a 5-0 victory and left all in attendance amazed at what they had seen. Black Knights head coach Brian Riley explains how the event came together. Well, actually, uh, Brian Sherry, uh, our assistant coach, ran into somebody with their organization, and they started talking. And you know, Brian came back and, and asked, you know, if, if that's something that we'd be interested in doing. And for us, I mean, that's a no-brainer. Um, it, it, it was a positive experience. It was uh, something that, like I said, uh, I think really went a long ways toward uh, um, you know helping our players to to, to understand. Uh, maybe how important it is to, to get out there and, and give something back. And, uh, but just, like I said, a real positive experience for everybody that was here that night. And, and I was so glad that so many people that were at our game actually stayed around and, and, and watched because uh, I think all of them left here, you know, kind of in, in amazement with, uh, with what those kids were doing out there. Senior defenseman Zach McKelvey, one of the Black Knights to take the ice against the Rough Riders, talks about the experience. Uh, sled hockey was obviously a great experience. You know, Coach said, told us that it would be a great experience, and it was. I mean, you kind of see that, you know, even though those guys, uh, you know, they don't play hockey like us, they have the same passion for the sport, and it's just, it's really refreshing to see, uh, you know, kids and adults uh, have the same passion as, as all of us do. After making 22 saves in the win over Canisius, junior netminder Josh Castle watched from the Army bench. He enjoyed the game as well as watching senior forward Aaron Anderson take his place in goal. Uh, those guys are awesome. I couldn't believe how uh, how well they could shoot the puck and they were really sniping it out there. And uh, to see Andy in the net was pretty good. He was wearing my other mask and took a ringer off the face a couple times. So uh, <laughs> to see him make a few good saves was was uh, pretty funny. Riley reflects one more time on what was a great experience for all involved. That was about the game of life and, and uh, sometimes you take for granted maybe what you have or, or, or sometimes you think you have it rough and you get out on the ice with those uh, uh, with those kids that we were out there with uh, on Saturday night and, and I mean our, our guys jaws were dropping at, at you know the amazement of what those kids could do you know even with their limitations maybe. Uh, but certainly an, an experience that I don't think any of us will ever forget that we're here on Saturday night and, and hopefully that's something that we'll be able to do uh, on a yearly basis, be, being able to get that.